All right, folks, welcome back. Today we are going thrifting for golf clubs once again, but we are exploring a new area. We've been on quite the uh, hot streak, though, so hopefully it continues today. Mm -hmm. Last video, we found a uh, Odyssey Stroke Lab, then we found a uh, Scotty Cameron. Plus, before that, we found a full set of Callaway Rogues and a Tour Shivoki. Yeah, so uh, hopefully the uh, luck continues yeah. today. But we're starting things off at a Goodwill. It's newer, so I don't know what that makes it better or not, but we'll find out. We'll find out. Whoa, this place is huge. It's got the Moore store in the back. Still haven't located the golf clubs, but the shoe section definitely had some uh, stuff. We got some uh, Jordan 1 Lowe's. These ones, we'll throw up some uh, eBay comps really mm -hmm. quick on these. Those go for like about $100. Like we got design. some, it's cool. yeah, it's cool. And then we got some uh, True Lynx wear that's go for about $50. Those yeah. are golf shoes, so we're staying on topic, hopefully. Someone. But uh, we got some Jordan 5s. I think this ones are called like the Cactus or something like that. Didn't look these ones up yet. They're 17 bucks, but uh, yeah, it's kind of cool. Mm -hmm. this one's cool hopefully the uh, golf clubs are as cool as the shoes. Yeah. Still haven't found the golf clubs. Let's see if it's in the uh, Moore store. Oh yeah, right next to the crutches. So my game is uh, <laughs> my it's hobbling right now. Let's see if there's anything uh, worth picking up. We got an AccuCore driver. That thing looks uh, very uh, interesting. A swoop Razor. Shroop, oh, Razor Golf. I haven't actually seen those in person. They're, I don't know how I stumbled upon their website like one time and they had, is their website's very weird. They like name their drivers like the Demonic or something like that. Uh -huh. They're not worth anything, but it's kind of interesting. interesting It'd be kind of funny if it was a full set to uh, uh it might be actually be a full set. <laughs> eh, I take that back. They're not interesting enough to uh, get. <laughs> but uh, we got a uh, McGregor. That thing is awesome right there. A one and a half wood. What? Is that persimmon? That thing is awesome. Definitely have to uh, try that out. Someone broke some glass in the uh, back. Got some uh, old school McGregor Tommy Armor tourney yeah, irons. Those cool. are stunning. Uh, let's see if there's anything else worth picking up. We're definitely gonna get that one and a half wood. Uh, Comment below if you see anything that we're missing. Got a Northwestern uh, Shot Saver wedge, kind of like the uh, Ben Hogan Sure Out, Old Wilson 1200 uh, wood set over there. McGregor four wood. Oh, it's an Iomatic oil heart, and that's a persimmon. That one's really cool too. The four wood right there. Oh yeah. Yeah, we'll get that in the one and a half wood. We'll be good to go. <laughs> be on the fast tracks. Fast tracks? Oh yeah, it's like a tailor-made railer uh, knockoff. <laughs> All right, we got some shoes. We got a hat. Good to go. I wonder if anybody saw that and commented when I said, see if we uh, missed anything. There's a Ping I-2-3 iron right there. We'll definitely get that too. with your eyes. Yeah. Whoa, it's a 15 wood. Loft, 36 degrees. Oh, look at that, the side angle. That's intense. Oh, it's like a wedge wood almost. Huh. It was a very interesting good wood. Nothing really of a crazy value in terms of the golf stuff, but. Interesting. Interesting to say the least. All right, interesting start to the day. Also, the uh, Goodwill prices over here are a little bit higher. The yeah. uh, golf clubs are six dollars a piece, and I think then it's like fifty dollar total. But I did find some t-shirts for myself. So yeah, I'll Ashley uh, scored some t-shirts, but uh, yeah, we'll meet you at the uh, next spot. Let us know what the Goodwill prices are in your area. Another buzzer. Oh, we've been to this one before. I forgot about this one. How's it going? Yeah, we found a uh, Cowboy Maverick hybrid before. How do we? Oh, we were on the way to the Strawberry Festival. Yep. Oh, I think these are Titleist CBs, two ninety nine on those, left handed. Got Dynamic Gold Tour issue shafts and multi compound grips. Might ask about that. How's it going? I was uh, wanted to take a look at the uh, irons, but they're like zip tied up there on the top. All right, give us one second. Cool. I'll hold them if you want. Thank <laughs> you. Be the first time, so yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nice catch. Thank you. Sometimes I'm known for a clip. <laughs> <laughs> or Butterfinger, Sam. <laughs> cool. There you go. I'll put them back Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, pitching wedge. And do you know what the best you'll be able to do in these? Yeah, I could double check. Give me cool. one second. Okay. Thank you. 200. Okay. You do 200 out the door. I'm going to let this right in the freezer and it exploded. <laughs> <laughs> Check message from my boss, man. So okay. Why? I guess we did inventory and he didn't get scanned or something, and he oh, put okay. it like somebody lost it or we got oh. rid of it. Or, <laughs> Here is your receipt. Awesome. awesome. Thank, Thank you. you. You're welcome. You tell the one for anything. You too. Thanks. <laughs> All right. $200 out the door. You cannot beat that. Apparently, it was like lost in their inventory system, so yeah. they just basically said whatever. Titleist uh, 714 CBs, left-handed. Worked out for us. Worked out for us. That was a uh, crazy deal. Yes, it was. Those guys in there are super nice, too. Mm -hmm. 
Also, those are the most zip ties I've ever seen on a set of clubs ever. Also, I felt bad for the girl because she had to like cut off like 30. Yeah, also, did you hear that a Sprite exploded in their freezer? Yeah, it was a casualty of a uh, Sprite. It exploded <laughs> in the fun. freezer. Interesting stuff. We'll see you next time. <laughs> or, or at the next place. <laughs> There's an outro for it. <laughs> All right, lunchtime. This place is 4.7 out of 5 stars. It is a sandwich shop breakfast and it has a bar in there this could be very interesting this place is amazing they've got a 725 reuben they've got a kielbasa platter a franks and beans three dollar beer and breakfast all day breakfast all day with beer <laughs> also we got iced teas check this out they've got the uh advertising on there i don't remember the last time i've seen that also they've got these like beer uh lamps shades and uh, a little private booth they're a private booth back here Updates to come. Every single condiment you could ever want, and you know it's good. They got schmuckers and boar's head. Schmuckers and boar's head. What's better? Nothing. Food has arrived. Ashley's got herself a smorgasbord over My there. Breakfast was called Fat Jacks, and I made it even fatter because I ordered sausage gravy. <laughs> Oh my goodness. <laughs> Mine looks like tiny compared to uh, Ashley's. I did get a uh, side of coleslaw. I'm indulging. Is that good? And you're more than welcome to some of my feast. <laughs> Everybody's welcome. Everybody watching the video could eat off of that. Also, Ashley got a side of pickles with her breakfast. She already ate four pickles. It was an appetizer. Uh, John got pastrami. It's boar's head. It looks delicious. Mm hmm. That's a nice crunch. That was good. Can't you do it? Ashley competitive food eating uh, challenges coming soon. Tiny human versus food. You gonna finish your pickle? No, you can have my pickle. <laughs> How's it going? Do you guys have any golf clubs or have any coming out? Right, thank you. No golf clubs, but sneaker channel coming soon. These things are awesome. Those are Air Max 90s. Yeah. It's like Christmas themed. Christmas in July. Oh. Those are amazing. Who wears it best? Air Max 90s. <laughs> That's an outfit right there. Came to party. Ashley's gonna get him. She's gonna go negotiate. See how she does. You know what the best you can do with me? 45 bucks. Out the door? Yeah, I could do that. There we go. Ashley did the negotiating. She got him for $45 out the door. Those are the, I forget what they're called. They're the Geo Nordic. Super cool. They Christmas are. Theme. Christmas theme. I wear them all summer. Sneaker channel coming soon. We'll meet you to the next spot, and I promise there will be golf clubs, or we will not show it. Yes. We're getting off track. I told you we'd find a place with golf clubs, not whether there's any good deals. I didn't promise that. Nope. That was not promised. Updates to come. All right, no crazy deals in here, but we are going to pick up uh, one thing, and it's not this. This was kind of interesting, though. It's a uh, Hanma TW747, and I've never seen one of these used. I thought it would go for around $230, something like that. It's going for... $235, which I thought would be a pretty good deal, but on eBay, those things are only going for like $130. That's pretty crazy. The whole appreciation. Yeah, the whole market has dropped out on those, especially the uh, irons. Even the uh, um, Justin Rose prototypes, they were like $1,400 new. They're only going for like $400. We sell those at Edwin Watts for like $400. Yeah. But the thing we are going to uh, pick up over here, all the pre-owned stuff is uh, scattered about. We are going to pick up this uh, Callaway Steelhead XR3 Plus, so the strong lofted three wood, only $60. This thing goes for $100 on uh, eBay mm -hmm. also. One of our favorites, the Ping G series. The Ping G series and the Ping uh, G30. It's a pretty good deal, $79 on that, but we've- uh... But more important, is this thing for sale? I don't think so. It's oh, pretty yeah. awesome. That staff bag is amazing. It's my size. All right, last stop. Oh, you can't even see the sign, but this is a Played Against Sports and it's in an old bank. This should be uh, interesting. There you go, there's the sign. Played Against Sports. I wasn't lying. Oh, it's a two-story. It's amazing. Yeah. Get the, golf clubs in the, vault? the golf clubs are in the vault is that what you're saying <laughs> I hope so. that'd be amazing i don't know they're over here almost yes. as exciting all right looks like they've got a ton of clubs in here and this is kind of cool they have them uh marked for the uh, flex on there regular stiff senior oh. and ladies yeah makes it easier so you don't turn what if it's over? extra stiff then it's not marked i don't know we'll there have to ask but uh, they <laughs> kind of funny they have the hanwa and it's the exact same price as they had at a uh, dick sporting goods and what else we got over here Got a tailor-made uh, M2. Oh, it's cool that they have the uh, head covers attached to it as well. Oh, that's clever. 249 for the 2017 M2. Walk off. Arrow burner TP. For 109. 109. Yeah, I had that with the Aldi Law NV shaft. That thing was amazing. I don't know why I ever sold it. Oh, they got a uh, Scotty Cameron bullseye. Oh, nice. That thing's pretty sweet. My dad used that for a while. What else do we got over here? We got a Cleveland chipper going for $69. Someone's trying to break into the vault. <laughs> <laughs> 
What do we got? Oh, sweet. We got a Betonardi. Is this an Armlock or just a Jumbo Max Grip? 199. That Let's is just a Jumbo Max Grip. Yeah, it's not offset. That thing is really cool. I've never seen that finish before. Uh huh. That thing's awesome. Oh, they got a bunch of iron sets too. Let's see if there's anything good. Some old Titleist uh, DCI 822 OS's. Oh, nice. Look at these. Taylor made rack LTs. <laughs> I was on the uh, hunt for these forever, and then in one of our unboxings, uh, one of our subscribers, Vivek, sent them. He sent them all the way from uh, Japan. Yeah, I think they made a pit stop in... Uh, yeah, he sent them to, like, Japan, then to England, and then they came through, like, a global shipping thing. Yeah. That was awesome. Thank you for all the trouble. Yeah, thank you for all the trouble. I think they were the Japanese edition, too, because they had a shaft that I, like, it looked stock, but I had never seen it before. Mm -hmm. I forget to uh, look that up. Get some uh, Ping S58s, 229. What else we got over here? Oh, nice. We got some uh, Apex Edges. Those things build a combo set with the Apex uh, blades that we got. Oh, $99. Actually, a really good deal on that. What flex are these? Three, so that's regular. Mm -hmm. Oh, nice. Right next to uh, another. Uh, <laughs> I always say that the uh, Ben Hogan Apex Edge, if you're just starting out, you want something that like looks good and is super forgiving. Mm -hmm. Those are the ones to uh, go for. And that they also feel really good. Did I say that? I yeah. said they were all good looking. The yeah, they're all good the above. Good looking, forgiving, and feel good. Also, if you want to get into the uh, Nike realm, I know that they're super collectible. We talk about it all the time. This is one of the least collectible of them, the uh, Nike CCI. I like them a lot. I don't know why they don't go for that much. I think um, it was either Trevor Immelman. I think Trevor Immelman used these to uh, win the uh, Masters. Don't quote me on that. $160 on that. Already been marked down. Mm -hmm. Dynamic gold uh, shafts on there. It's a pretty good deal on those, actually. Oh, they got the, we were just talking about the uh, old Ben Hogan's. We got a, a newer one oh, right ben here. Hogan, yeah. yeah, Ben Hogan Apex Edge. I think they just call these the Ben Hogan Edge now because Apex is with uh, Callaway. Oh, yeah. These go for like, <laughs> yeah, there you go. 20 years and basically a different company. How much are these going for? These usually go for like 400 or $500 on eBay. Um, two forty nine. That's actually a really good deal. Six iron all the way down to the pitching wedge with a. Well, they got recoil. Sha yeah, recoil shafts in there. I have to uh, pick those up. See if there's anything else. Cool. Right. Competitive <laughs> eating championship. Just like we were talking about. You got competition, Ash. <laughs> we got the uh, lefty section over here. I got a ping G four hundred lob wedge. Going for 60 bucks, actually a really good deal. The uh, lob wedges of the penguins, we talked about that a lot. Mm -hmm. And these things go for like basically 80 to $90, sometimes over a hundred, especially if it's lefty. Got the uh, AMT shaft in there. Like that, oh, a lefty uh, Wedgwood. It's like I said, there's two of them. Huh. I've never seen a lefty Wedgwood. Well, this might not be the smartest thing that we've ever done, but I think we're gonna get both sets of the uh, Ben Hogan Apex Edge. I didn't even realize that these were the uh, Ben Hogan Apex Edge Pro, which are a little bit more desirable and mm -hmm. yeah. uh, those might make the bag. There's. You should have known better you're going to get both. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and we're also getting the uh, Ping G400 uh, yes. lob wedge. But it's, it's lefty, a, so at least you're yeah. not keeping this in the bag. It's been, a, been a lefty day. It's been a lefty day. And a Ben Hogan day. <laughs> it's been a good day. <laughs> All right, folks, how about that for an ending Ben Hogan overload yeah, there? I think we broke the bank on that we one. Did, we broke the bank on that one. There you go. That was the best dad joke Thank of the uh, day. Rusty, but I'm good. You were uh, a little rusty. I didn't get half of them, but that's nothing uh, new here. But uh, hope you guys did like this video. It's getting ready to storm. I hear you guys, I'm sure you guys can hear the uh, wind and everything. And it's uh, getting a little late, so. Yeah, probably not the uh, best combination, lightning and darkness. No, we're testing these out. Yeah, but uh, let us know if you want a, a full video yes. on the uh, Ben Hogan Apex Edge versus the uh, the newer Ben Hogan Ooh. Edges. Yeah, it'll be fun. Yeah, it'll be a lot of fun. Maybe 3,000. I don't even need a lot of likes for that one. <laughs> Do it anyway. 3,000 3, 3, likes. likes. <laughs> yeah, we also have the uh, the Club Champion video coming soon, the uh, custom fitting. Yep. Yeah, it's getting close to uh, 5,000 likes on that one, so... Mm -hmm. I don't know how I feel about that. It's going to be very we'll awkward. Find yeah, we're going to uh, find out one way or another. Also, we got the uh, winner of the... Uh, uh, Seymour Putter yes. from the uh, last video. All you had to do is like the video, be a subscriber, and comment your favorite major. So congrats to the winner. Yeah, congrats to the winner. I think we had over 2,000 entries on mm -hmm. the uh, Seymour Putter, so lots of fun. Yeah. Hope you guys did like this video. Shoe shopping. <laughs> the best, uh, that was an awesome diner. Oh my gosh, that was so good. Florida diners are kind of hit and miss. That was definitely a hit. Yes, it was. Also, Ashley's shoes down there, a hit. Very comfy. Very comfy, yeah. And stylish. <laughs> I don't know if they're stylish. I don't know if our shoes are stylish. They're just very weird. Yes. But I hope you guys did like this video. If you did hit like button and subscribe. And see you next time. See you next time. That played against sports is pretty awesome. Yep. It's bankable. Oh. God, that was terrible. That was bad. That was Sorry. Bad. Sorry, guys. Yeah. See you next time. Well, it was a Waffle House.